County Corrections Officer is in jail tonight, accused of sending confidential mm. information about street racing groups using the app Snapchat. Thanks for trusting us here. I'm Shari Armstrong. And I'm Nadine Yana. So Fox 4's Caitlin Knapp is live in studio with us tonight, breaking this down. And Caitlin says the sheriff said that something as simple as a Snapchat post can really hurt this investigation. Yeah, he said that it could show confidential informants, information about the investigation, and people working undercover. Four photos, Marcino says, were posted on Snapchat to warn the street racing groups. And the sheriff's office says this man is behind it, 18-year-old Gure Uzin. The sheriff's office says about two weeks ago, they found a screenshot of a sheriff's office computer screen with the leaked information. They discovered it, and it was an exact match to an internal program that stores work about street racing investigations. Detectives traced all of this to a date, time, and computer at their core facility and identified Uzin as the one who allegedly posted the screenshots on Snapchat. Is the people that are involved in the investigation now get intelligence that they're not supposed to see, and that hurts our investigation. Uzin was arrested at his home yesterday in Collier County and has been fired. He's charged with disclosing confidential criminal justice information. Uzin had only been a corrections officer for nine months and just recently finished field training. Now, for this particular program, only certified deputies and officers can access it, about 1,100 people. So I asked the sheriff if this incident has them rethinking who has access to information like this. That's the story I'm working on tonight on Fox 4 at 6. Live in studio, Caitlin Knapp, Fox 4.